Yep, what it do squad, it's your boy Geek Samurai Welcome to another video This is a video I want to talk about This is an episode of Geek Samurai TV Where I want to bring y'all that straight fire Now on this episode, I want to talk about Spider-Man Miles Morales Coming out for PS5 Yo, I am excited Not only for this console, next gen But this is the first game that I'm going to get Alright, without any further ado Let's jump into this new trailer Let's go, T for team. Woo, next gen, God of War. Now, this is a showcase trailer for Miles Morales. I was at work when this dropped, I think Wednesday. So, I didn't even get to talk about it. But now, I'm going to talk about it. Insomniac, let's go. Marvel, baby, Marvel. TM that. Oh, my gosh, I'm so excited. Look at Miles. Look at that suit, man. Mm. It's all about that red and black. Graphics look amazing, dude. This better be 60 frames per second and everything, bro. God, I can't wait to play this, man. This is supposed to be him in Brooklyn. Because if you watch Spider-Man to the Spider-Verse, he's all up in Brooklyn, son. We're gonna be late, dog. Let's go. Hey, dude, I am so filling your suit with snow. Are you still wearing it? Love the headphones. Love that fur coat that he got on, bro. That's how New Yorkers do, man. We always gotta have the fur, man. I still got my fur. This is my favorite part of living in Harlem. Damn, look at the graphics, man. Damn. Look amazing, y'all. So what do you think about Rio Morales? You gonna vote for her? Still hard to think of mom. Just walking right through the city right there looks good. Similar skill sets, right? Rallying people, educating them, making sure they don't throw things at you. That must be his best friend or something. God, watching this made me want to go watch Spider Man to the Spider Verse, man. My favorite movie. Brian Horton, creative director of Insomniac Games. Okay. Our story picks up one year after the events of the first game, and we find Miles' new home, Harlem. One year after the after the 2018 Spider-Man. Okay. Spider-Man PS4. One year. Because you, if y'all remember, Squad, he was gonna be trained by Peter at the end. He had to do his homework, and that was his training. You do your homework, I'll train you. Peter Parker finally trained him. Whoa, who are these villains, bro? They look something out of like the purge with those masks. Where the underground tries to steal okay, we see the web slinger. Look at the new Spider Man. Okay. Bruh, I love that suit so much. Oh. Those costumes, I can't wait to unlock different costumes that he could wear. They better have Spider Man into the Spider Verse costume. I love that suit of Miles Morales. I need that suit. Oh, man. Something out of the purge with these masks. They look like some cyberpunk type of outfits. Damn. Look at the cinematics, man. These look good. Is that some Doc Ock arms? What? I don't even know the name of this group. Probably a group that, you know, Miles Morales fights in his universe. Bruh. That's that Venom strike. Oh. Ooh. Get out of that truck. about to explode on you, bruh. Use your spider sense. Bruh. Come on, Miles. You ain't no rookie, bruh. Your spider sense supposed to be tingling. You're supposed to jump out of that joint. Look at these masks, dude. Okay, now we get to see some real gameplay. Damn. I'm going to be using that Venom Strike like crazy. And he can go invisible, too. Damn, look at that, how he locks onto his freaking enemies. Oh. Bruh. 
You hit the L1, R1, and lock onto your people. You could take object and fling it back at them. Bro, spotted sense. That's what I'm talking about. Finally. Come on, bro. You gotta save them people. See, he went invisible. You saw that? Bro, I can't wait to use that. It's gonna be fantastic. That Venom Strike, man. Mm. Man, you gotta save that bus, bro. Brooklyn Bridge. See, it ain't broke. I told you. That's the Brooklyn Bridge he on. That's right, man. Every Spider-Man movie got him using his webs to freaking save a bus or a train or a boat, something. Swing, man. Oh, I cannot wait to play this, man. Oh. All one. There you go. Triangle lock on. Okay. Bro, you see all the webbing? I cannot wait to try this out, man. Damn. I like these quick time when you have to use the different buttons. Use quick time gameplay. I love it. Those quick time gameplay came from God of War. I love games like this. Because you got to time everything right. Or you will mess up. Either you die or you kill an innocent bystander. Oh. Just a god. Look at that. That's Spider-Man right there. See, every Spider-Man movie has this. Tobey Maguire Spider-Man did this. Miles, not Miles. Uh, Tom Holland's Spider-Man did this too. He has to hold the bridge together with his webbing. Look at that. Oh my God. Look at that. Bruh. I cannot wait. I cannot wait. That bridge is falling apart, bro. You better get up. Oh, yeah. We saw this in the trailer. Yeah, it is. We saw this in the first reveal of Spider-Man Miles Morales. Bro. Marvel. Spider-Man Miles Morales. Be greater. Be yourself. Holiday 2020. Bro. I'm on board, son. All right, squad. We just deep dive into this trailer, man. It look good. The gameplay look good. Brooklyn looks good. Seeing him walking through that with the fur coat. The graphics look amazing. This is the game. I mean, there's going to be a whole lot of, you know, exclusive games that's coming out to this next gen. But this game right here is the reason why I want to play and get this console, man. But I'm going to hold off on it. You know what I'm saying? I still got games for my PS4. And I'm hearing rumors that, you know, the PS5... When they drop this console, November 12th, it comes out, I believe. It's only going to be 500 gigabytes, man. I mean, I could pre-order it. I mean, you know what I'm saying? But my PS4 Pro, bruh, I get that joint one terabyte and I'm good. Plus, there's still games on this gen that I still have to beat and play. So, I might hold off a little bit. Probably by the end of the year, I'll get it. We'll see. I still got to play um, Marvel Avengers, there, that video game. I got to finish that Star Wars game. I'm still playing Call of Duty. I'm still playing NBA 2K21. And one thing I'm not liking is that, you know, PS5 is not going to be backwards compatible. So all the games that I got on PS4 right now, and I could be wrong about this, but all the games I got for right now might not show up on PS5. I might not be able to play those same games that I bought and purchased. Call of Duty, I paid for loot boxes and microtransactions. NBA 2K21, I paid all for the VC and everything. I might not be able to get that in this new console. Because when you have your ID, your PlayStation ID, it's only going to be able to lock on. You can't have it on two consoles because it's the PlayStation Network. It got to be on one console, bro. Facts. All right, squad. Let me know in the comment section below, down below, what y'all think about this trailer. What y'all think about this reveal. 
I I was able to watch finally like maybe Thursday. I was able to watch the whole showcase for PS5. But I wanted to talk specifically about Spider-Man Miles Morales because he's one of my favorite characters in the comic book. And no, not because he's black. I just love his powers. The Venom straight, going cloaking invisibility. I love all that. Peter Parker can't do that. Peter Parker can't do that. Even if even if um, Miles Morales runs out of his web webbing that he creates. He still got the venom strike, and he can still go invisible. So he don't need the webbing. The webbing is just uh, you know icing on the cake. You feel me? All right, school. I'm about to get up out of here. I already rambled on long enough about this video. I'm looking forward to this. I might get it at the end of the year. Maybe the new year. I might get it. Maybe Christmas. I might just get it. But I still gotta finish playing a whole lot of titles. I list a few from PS4 Pro. And I'm waiting for this new jet next gen to come up with a one terabyte. If it's going to come up with 500 gigabytes, these files of these games are huge. And the updates are huge. Every time they update the game, they're huge. 500 gigabytes is not going to be enough. Now, if this console comes out with one terabyte, I'm definitely going to cop that day one. Facts. I might wait and get the PS5 Pro. You never know. Because the Pro models, they usually help when you play online and you have all the, you know, the glitches and the lagging. You don't want that. So we'll see, man. You know, they still have to fix all the kinks and everything out of the, these models that come out. So I'm going to hold off a little bit. I might get it at the end of the year going into 2021. We'll see. January is right around the corner. 2020 is a really big, big mess up of a year. Everything that can go wrong has gone wrong in 2020. So I might just wait till the new year and cop this joint. All right, school. I'm about to get up out of here. Follow me down below on my Twitter handle at Geek Samurai TV. That's where I'll be posting my videos. Go check out, you know, the links over there. And like, follow your boy over there. Show him some love like you do over here for my new subscribers. All right, I'm about to get up out of here. Y'all already know what to do. Like, subscribe, and share the Geek Samurai. And until next time, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.